A federal proposal could place speed limits for boats and ships and restrict nighttime travel in some areas of the Gulf. The federal government is trying to save endangered whales. As News 5's Cody Long reports, the Santa Rosa County Commission has already passed a resolution opposing the rule. The National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration is considering a rule that would set a 10-knot speed limit for boats and ships in some parts of the Gulf of Mexico. We need to stop this horrible regulation from taking away our local people's freedom. The Santa Rosa County Commission passed a resolution that states they are against the proposal. I think a blanket opposition is not reasonable. Um, what I would ask you to do is to ask no on all the parties to come together and to roll up our sleeves and find solutions. Christian Wagley is with Healthy Gulf, one of the groups petitioning to have this role in place. The goal is to protect Rice's whales, one of the most endangered whale species in the world, with likely fewer than a hundred, most of those living in the Gulf. These are magnificent animals that really drive the ecology of our, of our offshore areas. Um, the fish that our fishermen go out to catch, the wahoo and the marlin and, and the swordfish, they're actually enriched um, and, and that system works better and is made better um, by the whales. If approved, the speed limitations would be in place for parts of the Gulf that are about 300 to 1300 feet deep. I fully agree with protecting the animals as best as we can, but we need to put people first. There could also be a nighttime travel ban in the area, raising some concerns that it would hinder activity at the ports in Pensacola and Mobile. Cody Long, WKRG News 5.